The Thermoscientific Nexa Surface Analysis System is our latest XPS instrument with multi-technique analysis and high throughput in mind. XPS can be used to analyze cathodes, anodes, and separator materials. For example, looking at the surface chemistry of pristine electrodes and comparing it to the surface chemistry of used electrodes. There are a couple of key challenges in analyzing lithium ion battery materials. Firstly, the materials can be sensitive to air. This means that even before they've entered the system, any exposure to air can change their chemistry. With Nexa, we also have a vacuum transfer module. This can be loaded with samples inside a glove box and then transported directly into the system without exposure to air. Secondly, lithium can be very difficult to detect, so a very high sensitive instrument is required. Multi-technique analysis of the Nexa is particularly valuable for analyzing lithium ion batteries. The unique capability of performing coincident XPS and Raman spectroscopy without removing the samples from the system ensures the most accurate data. So batteries with thin film solid state electrolytes are already in production. But over the next few years, there'll be an increasing demand to grow the energy output and power density of these batteries. Lithium phosphorus octinitride, or LIPON, is a candidate material that may enable this. But in order to fabricate these uh, LIPON films, we tend to use atomic layer deposition. In order to tune the electrical properties of these LIPON films, we try and modify the elemental concentrations or the chemical bonding of those elements. XPS is the ideal technique for analyzing the elemental concentrations and chemistry of lipon films. It's chemically selective, surface sensitive, and you can quantify without using standards. Lipon films can be fabricated with thicknesses anywhere from 10 nanometers up to one micron. For the thinner films, we can just use XPS to analyze the chemistry. But for the thicker films beyond 10 nanometers, we have to combine XPS with ion sputtering. Traditional forms of sputtering with monatomic argon plus are very good at quickly profiling through films, but they destroy the very chemistry we're trying to investigate. With Nexa equipped with Maxis, however, we can generate ion beams of argon clusters with anywhere from 75 up to 2,000 atoms of argon. With the smaller clusters, anywhere between 75 and 300 atoms, we can successfully sputter through lipon films without modifying the chemistry. With its high performance, multi-technique capabilities, and the ability to deal with air-sensitive materials, the Nexa is ideally suited for the analysis of lithium-ion and future battery technologies.